Okay, Ryland. So last time I saw you was Iron Man. The last yeah. time before that, we were in uh, Cheney, Washington together. Yeah. Uh, so I live in Parks, Washington, about two hours from Cheney. And uh, I know Robert's, uh, I kind of wrestle with him. I go up every during the week and train with them during. We drive two hours pretty much every night and when I'm home because there's not really too many clubs around me. So uh, Kevin runs a pretty good program up at Inland Northwest. Being a guy from, you know, the Rocky Mountain region out there, are you guys in the Palouse actually? Uh, yeah. So you're in the Palouse, but when you're out in that region, it's vast. It's huge. It's massive. I don't yeah. think a lot of people here get that. Yeah, so... Like, for me, to Seattle is six hours, and everyone, like, for gut check, everyone was like, so, you're you're back back home, and I'm like, no, it's six hours still, which, over on the East Coast, you can go through four states, then six hours, probably, yeah. So. It's so crazy, like, it's yeah. just so different out there, and it, travel's a big restriction. When you come to Blair, now you can duel Bergen Catholic, or yeah. whoever you're dueling, right, or Sam, and you, you can be home in your bed that night. Yeah, for sure. I remember, it's just like... I almost get, I guess just not used to it yet, but uh, I'm starting to get used to just wrestling, putting, I have to put together back-to-back -back good matches. That's the thing I've struggled with in the past is I, I've always been potential to beat a good guy, but I've never had the consistency to do it over and over, which I think that's what's helped me uh, to wrestle on our schedule. You're consistent now. Yeah. And you won the Iron Man. Are you undefeated on the year? Uh, no, I took a loss at Beast to uh, Pazanski in the finals. So you, you lost at the Beast, right? Yeah. So you win Iron Man, you win these important duels. You win the duel last week, yeah. right? You guys win the duel too. Yeah. Now it's preps. I'm talking to them. Same thing, like same interviews with the same guys as I'm having with you guys. Yeah. What do you got to do between Because that's it. You win preps, you win it. They win preps, they win it. Yeah. Right? And that's, it's that simple. What's, what's Coach Antonelli telling you? What's the staff telling you, Blair? Um, they never put winning in our mind. It's always go out and just perform your 100%. If you give 100%, then you can't be mad about the result. So that's a big thing for me is I want to I, – I feel like sometimes matches I get a little tight, and uh, I'd like to open up my matches and kind of let it flow, score, put some point, points on the board. And you're only a sophomore, right? Sophomore. So, you know, college choice, I asked Bazakas, he's a sophomore. And you guys are similar levels of yeah. recruits, right? He's like, yeah, I don't even care about that yet. You yeah. got a cousin who who's now on the Air Force, you know, uh, RTC staff. Yeah. And I think you Russell like him a lot. I saw you starting to assassin out there, by the way. Oh yeah, I was I was trying it last week. I got called for it was illegal, so I was like, like coach, I said I kind of told me to get away from it, so they didn't call me for it. But <laughs> he wasn't too happy with officiating. <laughs> Do you start looking at colleges? Um, obviously there's a few colleges I'd like to look at, and um. I think I talked to Bruce Burnett, that's kind of like one of my mentors, and uh, he, he said it's good to be looking at colleges ahead, but I, he had me create a list of like what I want to do, like what I want to do, what it, the factors are for college. So I, made it, I wrote out a list of what I think I want to, like I want to be in a big environment, that's my big thing, I want to be in a big crowd. So, and then uh, good at education system as, as well, um, and then, I want to fit a place that kind of fits my style, and even, not just in the wrestling room, but outdoors. It's like I, where I live, it's a lot of outdoor activities. So. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful. I mean, you've got to be starved a little bit in New Jersey. I'm yeah, not going to lie to you. I miss like my quad, for sure. I miss driving that around the mountains, but <laughs> for sure. All right. What's next for you guys? Uh, we have Naval Academy Prep next week. So, wrestling at Paul is 84 pounds. It should be fun. That's sweet. Yeah. So you got, what do you do for the weights? What do they do? Uh, so actually it's only like 26 up, I think, for wrestlers. It's, it's going to be crazy. That's really cool. But it's good. I, I've never, there's a big difference between high school and college, so uh, I'm excited. Awesome. All right, you got anything else for me? No. I'm hey, excited. Let's go. I'm going to be back out there this summer. Are you going to be back out there? Are you going to oh, be yeah, back home? sure. All right, well, we're doing there. the camp again at Roberts. Let's come over and train. Yeah. Cheney, uh, was it Eastern Washington? Yeah, Eastern Washington. The Red Turf or whatever? Yeah. All right. Hey, good luck to you moving forward. Thanks for the time, buddy. Thank you.